So it's me, your boy, K. Samson. So I have something special for us today. They thought they could abandon you and replace you, but quickly realize this. Quickly realize there, there is no one like you or better than you. So they were having that mindset, that thought that if they abandoned you, they reject you, that they will see someone somewhere better than you. <laughs> but they did not even see what <coughs> cat, not a place of what copper cotton. They did not even see what cat, not a place of what copper cotton. So, <laughs> so the issue here is this. They are what they are mad severely because they have come to realize whom you really are, your value, your, your your lifestyle. So they were thinking and having that mindset within them that if perventure, after they have messed up with you, after they have treated you the way they feel like, and after all those stuffs, there will still someone somewhere. To replace you that is more better than you <laughs> but they never know that everyone that surrounded them everyone who was around them are what are garbages like them <laughs> are what are fake like them you are the only real person within them you love them to the extent that you just want to be with them you just want to make life so easy for them because you were sent as an angel to locate them to, to do to do some certain stuff to help them to to help them amend their broken hearted to elevate them but things now become good they start to mess up with what with their answer they start to mess up with their own blessing so they were thinking having that thought that they will see someone to replace in your place they will see someone to do what? To use to replace you. But <coughs> no one can replace you as a choosing. No one can take your position because you are one in a million. They were thinking that you are one in two. That if one go, another one will still be found. That they will still see someone to replace you in their what in their place. <coughs> They were having that thought that if after they have messed up with you, use you, you know, do all sorts of things the way they like, that they will still see someone more better than you to replace you. But now they come to realize that no one is what is better than you. No one can treat them the way you do. No one can care the way you do. Maybe your ex, maybe your friendship. Your friends, your relatives, your brothers, your sisters, many of them are now realizing your value. <laughs> so many of them are now realizing your value, your identity. Oh my god, the sun is too much. Your what your value. They are now realizing the value, what you used to bring, the things that you carry, your joy that you give them, the peace of mind. They help, they assist, they support. Now that they are realizing everything, but it's too late for them. It's automatically too late for them because they have messed up with their own what with their own blessing. Yes, their mindset is that they will see someone to use to replace you. Their mindset towards you is that after they have messed up, treat you the way they like, that even if you leave. That they will still see someone somewhere they will see someone up there to use to replace you but they never have that thought maybe or it may it may be they never have this mindset because all their mindset is that they just want to take advantage of you not knowing that you are god sent into their life <laughs> So now they realize so quickly. <laughs> now they are praying to God. Oh God of Israel. Oh God of Israel. Do something that you do before. <laughs> God is telling them, act the same way you act before. <laughs> 
they are not praying. Oh God of Anna, oh God of Samuel, oh God that do it before, do what you do before, because mystery are around them. Oh God that surprise us, oh God that bring this guy, that bring this lady into our life. The same, oh God, do it the way you do it. But you said you never slump nor slumber. God, we need your miracle. <laughs> Like seriously, <laughs> hey God, you know some people, some people will not kill me with love. Some people will not finish me. It's too, it's too late for you to pray. They are not praying God. Oh God, surprise us with us. We, we bring him back to us. Oh Lord God, bring it back to us. Oh Lord God, bring him back to us. We need it. We need it. <laughs> But now, they are going to realize fully that God is now giving them a reply. Do the same thing you did before. Do the same thing you do before. Say you want to take him for granted. Take him for granted now. They are feeling your present. <laughs> they were thinking that they can mess up with a choosing and still have it for a second time. <laughs> so they are in mystery. They are in pain, sorrow without you. Their life is what incomplete, compl complicated right now without you because everything is turning around. Everything is turning against them. <laughs> so they are in pain and in mystery. Why? Because they messed up with someone who God has sent into their life to liberate them, to set them free, and to help them solve their problem. Because all their mindset is just to use you. All their mindset, all their thought towards you is just to take advantage. Now they realize your value. Now they realize, hey, this guy did used to give us peace of mind. Though. This guy is the reason why we are doing good. This guy is the cost why things we are working well for us. God of Anna, please, we have messed up. Don't disappoint us. And make it disappoint us. But we know you, God of Anna, will not disappoint us. And Jesse may disappoint us, but God, we don't want you to. <laughs> So they are in mystery without you. Their life is incomplete without you. They are insecure without you because mystery is knocking like a diamond. It's knocking like a rock in them because you are the diamond that God has released into their life. But they refuse to understand whom you are. You know what I'm saying? So remember blessed. I love you. <laughs> remember blessed. Mm -hmm.